Good day fellas, I hope you are ready for your daily dose of skill and today we are going to play with a Majestic T30 which is pretty beautiful tank, it, it is a hybrid between tank destroyer and heavy tank in my opinion and it is a tier 9 American tank destroyer. Um, all in all everything is fine with this tank although you cannot say you have excellent gun handling in tank destroyer standards and neither you can say you have uh, extremely good armor in the heavy tank standards, right? That's important thing to say. Also, looking into the community rating, um, after 311 votes, the tank is rated quite nicely and it looks pretty good, right? So let's try to make this beautiful mother trucker work. And let's play well. Ah, one more thing to say which is super important. If you want to raid the tanks yourself, you need to log in into the index page. Then you can raid the tanks yourself. If you have 50 games plus. Plus on top of that, if it is not enough, if index doesn't work for you because I heard them some people saying that either you need to relog in or either you need to clear patch um, and cookies or however it's called or catch and cookies whatever i'm not a pc guy okay just saying anyways when we have this out of the way let's start our journey and let's try to make this mother trucker work i had a warming up session i played three games with this tank i finished with uh, like 3.5 thousand damage or something like this and 700 assisting damage um uh, it's okay warming up, I cannot complain about this. Let's see, can we do any better than that? This is the question. Now, first battle, Ruinberg standard battle. Let's see, can our 50, um, 750 alpha damage gun treat us good? Let's see. I would love to see the person peeking like this and here we go. I was trying to hit that cupola, I must admit I was aiming towards it. A aim wasn't ideal, so I cannot complain for missing the shot like this. I am okay. We want to see enemies making silly goose mistakes. That's what we want to see. That's what we want to see, fellas. T95. Ooh, T95 doesn't uh, look like silly goose, does he? How we can slap the enemies in this situation? Now, obviously, I really need to highlight one thing. It's like this vehicle is like T-34, which is tier 8 heavy tank. And we are in the tier 9 bracket in a way. Obviously, the gun is absolutely amazing and gun is glorious and so on, so on. Uh, but that is important thing to say. So we cannot expect to bounce anything, you know, especially whenever we are uh, fighting against the one to two millimeter caliber plus gun, then it is uh, a game over and then it is no bueno, obviously. Where is this chair sitting at? I do not really think he's sitting here. Maybe he's here around the corner. What do you think is the chance of that? Let's go for a blind shot. Definitely not a blind shot. That is okay. Once again, let's have a slow approach and we are going to be fine. All I want to see, I want to see enemies making silly goose mistakes. We need enemies to get involved. If enemies are not involved, it's going to be a very hard game. If enemies are not getting involved, this is going to be very, very, very hard game. Okay, this is Cupola shot. I hope this guy won't block our angle. Come on, don't block our angle. I get the point. You want to play in front. I get it. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. That was very nice. Obviously, uh, um, lucky as well, but nice. Aim was top notch and we hit his cupola. Over a distance like this, this is good. Now, what we can expect here, you see this T95? I have a feeling that this T95 eventually will say Prrr, and he will get involved here. That's what I would love to see. I'm not getting spotted, so that means Char Futur shouldn't sit here. 
Oh, what a hard game. You see, sometimes games are like this when you just simply need to be patient. Whenever you cannot make too much of the pressure, if any, and when situation is completely different. And this is how it feels like to me in this game. We are just trying to get the right shot, the right angle to the enemies. Uh, four minutes into the game, the score is three to four. That's beautiful. More games like this, pretty please. Give me more games like this. No? Anyone making mistake, pretty please? Do I want to go for a blind shot like so? You know what? I will. Probably this is not a diary hit, but it's worth to try. I would say it is worth to try. T95. I mean, this T95 is waiting here around the corner. He doesn't really care too much about this. Listen. I am getting desperate at this point. I really want to make... A bit of pressure like this. It is not the ideal idea. I get the point, fellas. Believe me, I am uh, I am 100% with you. It is not the smartest choice. But sometimes I feel like I want to. And if I want to, I'm going for it. Okay, beautiful shot to the Pershing. Very, very nice. And now all we need to do, we need to get a bit more involved. Skill, how are you going to do this? I'm going into the middle of the street. How about that? We are trying to make pressure like this. Hopefully we will be able to eliminate this TN hush whenever he is going to move back. Because he should. It's a matter of the time and after that we can work on this T95 or T10 or Pershing. Doesn't really matter. We just need to eliminate this TN hush somehow. Okay, Mr. Borat is getting spotted, right? So let's wait for it. I'm still waiting patiently until he will make a mistake. Come on, just make a mistake. Apparently he doesn't really want to make a mistake. That's fine. I believe that's fair. How about this T10? 800 hit points, how are you doing this fine day? We are taking our time to aim and we are slapping him for 750. Beautiful. Very, very nice. I'm super happy about this. It's awesome. <sighs> it's only the start for us. There is still a lot of, a lot of, a lot of things for us to do. But we need to be smart. We need to be smart. I want to push this to 5,000 somehow. Oh, share footer. It's okay. This is not a bad thing for us whatsoever. Tian Hash died. Now, our Borat will try to flank this T95. At least that's what I assume. If our Borat will flank this T95, we are going to chill forever and ever. Oopsie. Beautiful. That is a solid ass shot. Very nice. Now all we need to do, we need to go for this chair footer. In, in fact, I would even go as far as maybe I can load some high explosive ammunition here. I mean, that would be greedy. Let's go. I'm greedy, mother trucker. Let's go. High explosive on. The main reason why am I going with high explosives because I want to hit him for a lot of damage. I hope that he will run towards us. Beautiful. And I did zero. Uh, I am a bit disappointed, fellas. What can I say? I am. I am a bit disappointed. I made a decision to be greedy instead of taking 750 damage and, um, well, let's say things did not went as well as planned. <laughs> oh well, what can you do? Accept your responsibility. Now, if everything will go well... We should, have, we should be able to find decent enough angle for Fosh. We hit the Fosh. I am going through the open field. I am very, very well aware of that. 
and I'm going to be greedy again. Skill, don't you dare. Listen, I need to. I am a very simple man. I want to be greedy. Am I asking too much? Beautiful. Now char futur. Now this is the tank we need to eliminate from the game. Very, very nice. Uh, five seconds left. I will risk it for the biscuit, obviously. 400. You know what we, what we can learn from all of this? Sometimes it is not worth to be greedy bastard. Sometimes it is significantly better to do 750 alpha damage in the face and just to feel good about this instead of risking and doing 800 damage. Okay, fine. I'm happy with this. Listen, this game was a roller coaster of emotions. Um, I mean, the, the worst part of all of this was the Char Futur uh, side uh, non-pen. You know, that was sad, but it's okay. The score overall is fine. I do not feel bad about my decisions, although this game was uh, holding line most of the time, and yet still enemies haven't made uh, uh, many mistakes by any shape or any form, right? Anyways, what do we have? 4.1 thousand damage, 1.5 thousand assisting damage. I'm Feeling happy about this. We are first uh, by experience, first by the damage, and we made 31,000 profits. Good, let's keep it up. Okay, Siegfried line encounter. Hmm, interesting. What we can do? This is the question. What we can do about this? I obviously do not want to play in the field. I think field is no bueno. I think field is no. It's just, it's just not good call. What I am actually thinking about doing is to take this corner over there. I think this is the right choice. From this corner, we are going to punish someone crossing like this and usually in an encounter they have someone going through the middle. This is exactly what I want to see. Obviously, alternative option could be to play uh, over there, hold down and slap someone who is playing here. But I think our decision is going to be better and definitely way less risky. That's what I am hoping for. Although, I'm not alone. We have IS-3 too. Unfortunate. But this is what I'm talking about. Uh, whenever you are playing over there, whenever we have an encounter, usually there is at least one gentleman who is making a silly goose mistake like this. Okay, Super Conqueror. Super Conqueror is going to be a problem, and I believe Super Conqueror and Phase 1 will sit here around the corner. That's what I want to believe. Let's see, am I correct or am I incorrect? Phase one, definitely, yes. Beautiful snapshot straight into the uh, turret. That was beautiful. And you know what? This gentleman, he's not trying to escape yet. Huh. Very interesting. I mean, if he's shooting gold, he's shredding me like hot knife through the butter. So I have a feeling I am going to wait here for a moment. I will wait until maybe someone will peek here. Um, or, anti or until enemies will try to get a bit involved like this, it's okay. We have uh, all time in the world. That's what we have. Minus 4,000 hit points. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. All time in the world, you say. Bad aim. Not much what I can change about this, just simply bad aim. Oh, this phase is making a mistake. Five seconds to go, four seconds to go, three seconds to go. Oy, 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 oy. Unfortunate for him. That was uh, that was greediness from his side. I believe he noticed that his team is uh, simply losing the game. Actually, his team is winning the game. So he said, listen, I need to get involved. If I won't get involved, I won't get anything done in this game. At least that's what I think. Meanwhile, Char Futur from the side. Oh, you naughty, naughty, naughty boy. I see what you are doing. Believe me, I see that. 
Okay. By the way, that uh, Char Futur got one-shotted by Death Star. Kind of well-deserved, if you would ask me. Anyways, how about this TVP? TVP is thinking about a great escape, but he is escaping in the garage. Unfortunate, although he did his best. Meanwhile, our E100 is playing the sumo fight against the Super Conqueror. And even though our tank is heavier, unfortunately, Super Conqueror has better gun. And there is nothing what our E100 can do about this. Unfortunately, there is nothing what he could do about this. Okay, how we could deal with this situation? I kind of want to peek sideways here. I truly want to peek sideways, fellas. Let's wait for a moment. I can see what he's doing. He's aiming directly at me. He just fired. Okay, how about that? If we would try to find a decent angle just like so. Pick. Hmm. Is he that smart? Is he that smart? I can hear Arta. Hmm. Beautiful. I was waiting very, very, very patiently for this. I was aiming this ideally. I was thinking, what is going to happen next? You know, this is this is uh, the thing which was happening in my head at the moment. What will happen next? And what happened? He took one for the team and he went to the garage. Absolutely glorious. Now, I would love to slab this standard B. I would love to slap him. Let's see, can we do everything properly? You see, our Fava, he might get slaughtered by the standard B and by the Artas. I think I should be able to help him. In fact, I will load high explosive skill. Are you greedy again? It's not greed. It is tactical decision, fellas. I want to see that 1000 roll. Am I doing something wrong? Am I doing something wrong? for dreaming about 1000 row look at this 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 980 in the face this is what i'm talking about and this is what i'm dreaming about you know this is what i need beautiful our Arta said hello for him. Obviously, he doesn't uh, appreciate it, but there is nothing what he can do about this. Now, Mr. Grille. Skill, are you going to go with high exp No, fellas. Shh. I just, I must admit, it is somehow oddly satisfying to see the rolls for 1000 damage plus. I mean, am I only one who feels this way? Am I only one who feels this way? Can't be, right? Okay. Oh, yo, papa. <sighs> oh, <m> <laughs> I, I do not want to talk about this. I, I do not want to talk about this. Never, ever, 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 fellas. Never, ever, ever, ever. But that was fun. Still, 800 in the face for Waffle. That is okay. I am feeling fine. Super Conqueror is making me to go straight to the garage. Oh, such a sadness. I mean, this shot should have been a, a killing shot on the um, waffle, but oh well, what can you do? Not much what I can change about this. Score isn't bad. 4.7 thousand damage and 300 assisting damage, but this game is full of the disappointments, if I can say so. Fine, let's teleport to the end.
Okay, fellas, we came back with a defeat. A bit of the disappointment, but what can you do? Score overall is good. 4.7 thousand damage, 300 assisting damage. Yeah, mistake to shoot the waffle with a high explosives, or maybe I needed to aim better. Either way, no complaints, no regrets. Let's go for a last game and let's try to make it work. I believe we will. Oh, boys, look at this much making. Lakeville. Hold down, play. Hold down, play. Skill, this is not winning game. Shh. Shh. We are going to be fine. We are going to be those naughty bastards. Playing in the one-two line, playing hold down and slapping literally everyone. How about that? That sounds like a good plan to me. Okay, so idea being, we want to take this magical bush. From this magical bush, we can spot their triangles. And in the same time, we can slap everyone who are playing here. Usually, there is two options how the things are looking like uh, whoever is playing over there. Either extremely good players who wants farm, 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 farm. Or alternatively, mm, clueless players who are relatively new in the game, who are uh, afraid of the city. Or alternatively, they know it's just simply easy play over there. One out of two. Right? At least this is how I look into all of this. Let's take our time to go up. Don't mind me if I do. I'm trying to go slowly but surely. Slowly but surely. And here we go. We are in position. Now. Ooh. Skill. Beautiful play skill. <laughs> Amazing. So, which one which one of those players are you? I just wonder, asking for a friend skill. The good player or, or the one who is taking one for the team? Well, first two minutes of the game, I lost literally all my hit points. That was impressive. That was impressive play. I am proud of myself. And oh boy, oh boy. That's amazing. What we figure it out? We figure it out that everyone shred us in the face and there is nothing what we can change about this. It's sad, but I cannot change anything, right? And in the same time, I think we are going to die here with one shot, honestly. I do not see how we can, how we can survive this battle, honestly. Enemies are going to make pressure through the middle, as you can see, without bigger problems whatsoever. And there is not much what we can change about this, and there is nothing what we can do. Luckily, we track the phase one, so that means we might get another shot over there, which would be very much appreciated. But the situation is very, very, very bad. I think uh, someone was a bit too greedy. I do not know who exactly, but I would... Let's not point the fingers who is the greedy bastard. And saying, oh, hold down position. I lately played with a chieftain and I, I have armor. <clears throat> when we have this out of the way, great. At this point, all we want to do, we want to hold the enemies. Simple as this. We do not care about anything else, just holding enemy team, right? Whenever enemies are making pressure, we are saying, oh, hi there, and we are slapping them in the face. That's all we want to do in this situation and in this game. I get the point I do not have hit points. I get the point Conqueror doesn't have hit points. I get the point enemies can grow big balls and they can try to make a humongous pressure. I understand. I get it, fellas. But some games are like this, some games are, uh, um, we can simply miscalculate and in the same time we can be just simply greedy bastards. And I think this is uh, one of those games whenever, uh, whenever greediness is leading you to take one for the team. This is how am I looking into all of this. Anyways, Mr. Cobra, straight to the garage, nice. Now. How the things will look like with Mr. Amax? Oh, Amax is saying blah, 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 blah. this is what is happening over there. It's okay. All I want to do, I want to have a decent enough angle to slap him. Beautiful slap in the side. He has only 200 hit points left. Although I do not really have the safe uh, spot over there. Is he baboon? 
Eski babun. Eski babun Arturist. I do not get it. I swear to banana lord, I do not get it. Both of the cases could be a, a possibility. I do not know. I hope he was a tourist. Fellas, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, I hope this gentleman was a tourist and not baboon. Because if he was baboon, I will never, ever, ever, ever forgive myself for being a naughty baboon killer. Bucket is dead, hibi hibi hooray. I mean, that's... That's weird. Oh, my bananas. Peace? Do you want to be friends? No? No, no means no. What can I say? No means no. That was weird. I hope he wasn't baboon, honestly. That's what I am hoping for. So... Let's talk this game. In this game, I was very, very greedy, mother trucker. Um... I made a mistake uh, to make a hardcore pressure uh, in the first minute of the game, right? Um, I pretty much took every and each shell uh, which enemy team had to offer and I simply played the tank wrong. Even though this tank has the good gun depression and everything, right? Unfortunately, the situation was just simply bad. But it happens. What can you do? Armor simply doesn't hold. And that's okay. You know, that's my mistake. Anyways, after two games, our performance was phenomenal. After third game, our performance is still okay. Considering we were down to fartable and we got 3,000, uh, I would say this is a great success. After two games, our score is 4.4 thousand damage and 1,000 assisting damage, and third game never happened. How about that? Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed yourself and see you very, very soon. Skill is out for today. Peace.